Hi, everybody. I'm Howard Fillett. I'm the founding executive director and chief science officer for the Alzheimer's Drug Discovery Foundation. So you may be wondering what challenges our scientists are facing in this era of working from home. And I can say that there are significant challenges in uh, moving the science forward as efficiently as possible uh, when people are mandated by many countries around the world um, to uh, shelter in place. To address this problem, the, um, the foundation can be quite flexible in our funding. We often uh, can create better time frames for investigators, extend deadlines, and I think that this um, problem, this challenge with the COVID virus uh, will only accelerate the, uh, the need and the trend towards using digital technologies in the context of clinical trials. Now, there are some advances that we're involved in through our Diagnostics Accelerator, where we're developing not only new biomarkers for Alzheimer's disease, uh, but also digital technologies that can be used uh, to monitor patients who are in clinical trials, things like computerized cognitive testing that can be done remotely, uh, memory testing that can be done on an iPhone, and a whole host of other ways that um, patients can be evaluated remotely. Another aspect to this problem is obviously clinical care. Uh, I'm a geriatrician by clinical training and I've been taking care of elderly people uh, for about 40 years now uh, with Alzheimer's disease. And um, the COVID-19 virus epidemic, pandemic, does create uh, serious challenges for elderly people. Um, first of all, obviously elderly people are at greater risk, especially if they have multiple diseases like diabetes and heart failure and lung disease. And the caregiving is extremely stressful uh, in the best of times. And in the face of uh, the COVID-19 virus and the social isolation that's mandated uh, for people to be staying at home and not being able to go out, I, I just can't even imagine the kind of stress that caregivers uh, must be experiencing now um, in taking care of uh, their loved ones 24-7. We talk about trying to get out of the house, get some respite. Um, when the home health aid comes, maybe just leave for a while, take a walk. I think to the degree that um, it's possible to do sort of meditation or yoga or exercise, um, stay hydrated, um, connect with loved ones, and I think finding ways to focus on relieving stresses would be my, my number one prescription for, for caregivers. I want to thank everyone for listening today about our perspective from the ADDF on um, how clinical research is progressing despite this terrible pandemic and any um, advice that we can help you with on caring for your loved ones that have Alzheimer's disease. If you'd like to email us, uh, please email us at uh, info at housediscovery.org, which you can see on your screen right now. Thank you for listening, and we look forward to uh, getting through this pandemic and continuing our work.